Hi all, welcome back. In this video, we will see how to filter data by clicking on the image. So here in this visualization, I have category, subcategory and sum of sales, which is represented by horizontal bar graph. Now when I'm clicking on the furniture image, I can see data for only furniture category. Similarly, when I'm clicking on office supply, my filter criteria is getting changed. So let's understand how to create this type of visualization. So basically there are three steps for creating such visualization. First one is add image as a shape. So we will do it in a first worksheet. In second worksheet, we will create visualization. Third, we will create a dashboard, add both the worksheets and shapes as filters. I have opened a worksheet. I am renaming it as shapes. First thing we will do is take category, place it in the rows. From the marks card, I am selecting shapes as a drop down. Now I will take category and place it in shapes. I can see by default, x mark is showing up as shapes i'll go to shapes of the image which i can select for furniture office supply and technologies category now let's understand if i want to add shape in this particular list i have to go to my tableau repository which is inside my documents then need to go to shapes and create a new folder I'll name it as a category. Then I'll go inside category folder and place images. So first one is furniture, second is office supply, and third one is technologies. Now I can go back to W. Click on reload shapes. Here in drop down, I can see category. I can select that. I'm clicking on furniture and assigning a furniture symbol to it. Assigning appropriate symbol to office supplies. Last one is technology. Clicking on apply and OK. Now I need to swap rows and columns. One way I can do is that take the category and place it in the columns. Second one is click on this icon, which would help me in swapping rows and columns. And third option is pressing Ctrl W. So I'm pressing Ctrl W over here. I will hide title. I'm hiding fill label. and will remove show header. So I have those three images, but they are small in the size. I am dragging it to increase the size. From the size chart, I am increasing the size of image. Now let's place category in the labels. Double click on label. Going to alignment. We'll select bottom and horizontal alignment will be center. Now we are left with only one thing that is hiding these lines. So I'm right clicking on this line, going to format, selecting borders, going to rows, and in rows, I'm selecting row divider as none. Our first worksheet is ready. In the second worksheet, we will create a visualization. So let me create a second worksheet from here. I am naming it as visualization, taking category in the rows. 
subcategory and adding sales. I'll select horizontal bar graph. Also placing category in the colors to distinguish different categories. Taking sales and placing in the labels. So here our second worksheet is ready. Now let's create a dashboard. Upon clicking on this sign, you would be able to create a dashboard. I'll take shapes worksheet and place it. Next, we will take visualization worksheet. I'll do some alignments. Hiding the title shapes. Again, hiding the title. Removing legends. Last step is to click on this icon, use as a filter. So this will help us in the filtering all the data within the dashboard. Now I can click on any of the category and my data would get filtered accordingly. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.